हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम डॉक्टर अनगा हेरू मेडिकल डायरेक्टर अनिल आई हॉस्पिटल लेसिक इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट पॉपुलर एंड मोस्ट कॉमनली परफॉर्म्ड सर्जरीज टू गेट रेड ऑफ ग्लासेस सो इफ वन वॉन्ट्स टू गेट रेड ऑफ ग्लासेज लेसिक इज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट ऑप्शन यू कैन चूज बट इन ऑर्डर टू मेक इट मोर सेफ वॉट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट इज वी नीड टू हैव अ प्री लेसिक वर्कअप सो एट अनिल आई हॉस्पिटल वी इंसिस्ट that a pre lasik workup is done for every patient and we ensure that all the criteria are met so that your surgery becomes safe and successful so let's see today what are the tests that are done in the pre lasik workup the first and the foremost test is a perfect refraction that means checking of your number is done perfectly so that that number is fed into the computer of the lasik machine and we get a perfect accurate and a precise result the second test is the checking of the internal part of the eye a general check up to see the eye pressure whether it is normal or not whether the internal natural lens is clear or not and whether all the other parameters are normal or not third important test is the check of the retina which means that if the retina has any changes because of high myopia a lot of patients with high minus numbers can have changes in the peripheral parts of the retina so a retina consultant checks each part of your retina to confirm that there are no issues however if there are certain changes in the eye then they will advise you a special barrage laser technique to strengthen those areas so that you become fit for the lasik surgery coming to the most important part of the pre lasik workup now the cornea is where the lasik is actually performed we take a flap of the cornea and we put laser on the surface so the thickness of the cornea is the most important okay it is called as pachymetry so the tests that we do are a corneal topography a pentacam and a serious test so these are the tests that will check the corneal thickness the corneal curvature the corneal shape so the shape curvature and thickness will determine what kind of lasik procedure or what kind of laser procedure is good for your eye so if there are changes in the corneal curvature or a corneal thickness which is very less we would suggest different options of laser procedures for you one of the other tests that we do is a dry eye test that means post lasik surgery some patients experience a little bit of dryness for a few months so during the lasik workup we also check whether there is any pre existing dryness in the eyes we do a special test like a shermer's test where a small filter paper is kept at the edge of the eye for 5 minutes and then we see how much is the wetting ability a lot of questions are asked whether you have used contact lenses in the past how much of night driving is done whether your number has been stable or not ideally the number should be stable for the last 6 uh, months at least and then we proceed for the planning also in the uh, corneal topography and the pentacam test we look at the scotopic pupil diameter which means how much does the pupil dilate at night and depending on that we check what and we decide what is the optical zone of your laser procedure once all these tests are done we go ahead with planning and calculation so the planning and calculation is the heart of the lasik surgery that decides what are the options that are given to you and how we go about the procedure so friends today if you have a number and you want to get rid of glasses all you need to do is come to us and we do a proper precise pre lasik workup in the workup all these tests are done to ensure that your surgery is going to be super successful and your vision is going to be bright and nice without glasses so be ready and book your test for your pre lasik workup today thank you